Part 4 Create Shop Drawing Log. The Shop Drawing Log is an Excel file which will allow the document uh, controller to enter all the shop drawings and keep monitoring the process of shop drawing from submittal approval and how many days this bending with the consultant and so on. The shop drawing log is uh, mainly prepared by the planning engineer then with the coordination of the technical office department you giving them a summary uh, shop drawing log then they start doing some details on this one and further breakdown they divided each drawing into some parts uh, and so on so let's go and see how to create this shop drawing log and what is the benefit of Primavera dates how it can help us in this process this is our sample shop drawing submetal log we have here some columns this is serial number this is activity ID this is submetal sequence number uh, uh, when you submitting uh, anything to the client or to the consultant there is some reference number or sequential ROM number this one you should put here for monitoring this revision which tells you this document the revision of the document the trade here architectural mechanical uh, electrical this is for uh, filtering purpose then the description of the shop drawing then we have here the planned submission the submission date and the actual submission date when it is returned back from the consultant the date of return and what is the action code the, there is some action codes a it is approved without comment p code it's approved uh, with comment c it is uh, uh, revised and resubmit and d is rejected and this one this is status we shall put here open or closed and if you have any remarks here so let's go to our promovera file this is the shop drawing section in our promovera so in shop drawing submetal i'm going to select it and copy then make a new sheet in the excel new workbook and i have here the list of the shop drawing i don't need the total float so just i'll delete it and i'll go here i have this is let's do the heading this is architectural shop drawing after architectural shop drawing we have uh, earthwork let's see what is our breakdown we have earthwork concrete work and finishes work MAP work for the shop drawing then earth works after the earth works we have concrete works Just doing this sample and I want to do a complete sample in order to tell you how to do it. Then we have here finishes work. We have here only few activities so I can cut and set cut cells here. Finishes work a little bit as well. I can cut insert cut cells here. Okay, so I'm going to copy for the earth, earth work. This is activity ID. Copy paste one, two, three.
here revision zero trade is civil description excavation should drawing the plan submitted date okay is equal to here we'll take the finish date the finish date means it is ready for submission so we'll take the finish date of this one then we'll keep everything else empty because nothing we can add now for the concrete work so this is a point one point one this is how to number this one this is a point two let's say and then a point two point one the activity id for the concrete work we can make it equal to this one starting from the footing then we can control find here replace make two spaces and replace all order to remove all the spaces so here this revision zero this is concrete wall and this equal to this and the plan date you can get it from the finish date this should be from the finish date then we can drag this one up to here right click double click to make it all zero and this is the concrete work we have the dates already here for the concrete work we want to change the format to show the year as well so from format cells I change date here and show the year finishes work will do the same here it is okay this is revision zero this is finishes work and this is the activity name and this is the finish date okay and this is a sample of what we can do for the uh, shop drawing submittal log. Usually we are sending this shop drawing submittal log to our technical office in order for them to add more details here. The excavation shop drawing could be two or three drawings. So we have here the latest date they, submit, they, they should submit the shop drawing. They can add part one, part two, part three and so on and we give them as well the activity id so they should uh, uh, refer to this activity id for all the breakdown they will do okay now let's say that i submitted this drawing on 15 july and the return date is 25 july the action code could be uh, b it mean approved the status is closed now here I have the color coding when it, is, it was white it means no action now it is closed so I should fill it with gray color this means closed in that case okay if we assume that I send it to to the uh, consultant on 15 July and today is end of July let's say today end of July and I, I didn't receive any response in that case I will mark it as red this is delayed if the data date is 17 
July and still within the period of the uh, review for uh, from the consultant so this means on progress this is just a color coding I prefer to use it so easily you can monitor what is the status of each drawing and each one of them okay now I want you to complete this Excel sheet as well and uh, after completing the Primavera uh, uh, shop drawings in the Primavera please complete it as well in the Excel and send it to me to my email thank you for watching this video and see you in the next one